We've seen her flatline in the hospital. We've said goodbye. You're listening to Matt and Paige Figgy describe their own daughter. What would you do if this were your child? Charlotte Figgy had an extreme form of epilepsy. Her body was so frail that any seizure could kill her. With no traditional treatment left to try and the clock ticking away, her parents decided to try marijuana. Charlotte was just five years old. You need a card in order mm -hmm. to be able to get the cannabis from a pharmacy. Doctors have to prescribe it. You need two doctors in Colorado uh, to get the card for a, a juvenile or a child. It was hard. We were the first young child, and they said no. Everyone said no, 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 no. Certainly her age played a, played a role in, in my hesitance. Dr. Alan Shackelford is a Harvard-trained physician. He's also among a handful of doctors in Colorado who give prescriptions for medical marijuana. From the moment Charlotte entered his office, he knew she was in trouble. While he was just examining her, she had two seizures. She'd failed everything. Uh, there were no more options for her. Everything had been tried, except cannabis. Here's how scientists think it might work. Marijuana is made up of two main ingredients. THC, that's the psychoactive part that makes you high, and CBD, also called cannabidiol. It's the CBD that scientists think modulates electrical and chemical activity to help quiet the excessive activity in the brain that causes seizures. I measured it with a syringe and squirted it under her tongue. It was exciting and very nerve-wracking. Holding Charlotte in her arms, Paige waited. An hour ticked by, and then another, and then another. She didn't have a seizure that day. And then she didn't have a seizure that night. Did you sit there and sit yeah. there look at your watch? And... Right, I thought, this is crazy. And yeah. then she didn't have one the next day. And then the next day. And I thought, that is, yeah. she would have had 100 by now. In his compelling documentary, Weed. You've looked at the evidence. There is real science now out there. He was flat out wrong about weed. A year-long journey that changed what many of us thought about marijuana, myself included. I think, you know, we've been terribly and systematically misled. We used to only picture this. Then we showed you this. Medical marijuana treating seizures, pain, dozens of other ailments. Charlotte's doing amazing, just better and better each month. But we learned this wasn't the end of the story. It was just the beginning. I think we went from about 150 calls a month to over 4,000. There are still so many issues to be addressed. The federal government says marijuana is among the most addictive drugs with no medicinal value. Many serious scientists say they're wrong. It's a medicine. It's the politics of pot, pitting policy against patients. Trapped in the middle, sick, qualified people who want medical marijuana but can't get it because it's illegal. If you try to go back to Ohio with Jordan's medication, we'll be arrested. 